The lady on the BBC just, just did say, we don't mind paying for 80 or a country stuff TV. Well, I know what I've got to say. I've got a voice, literally. I'm a port in England where they're not interested in me. The BBC is full of it. And I'm not going to swear. I'm not going to say, mm, I'll say it. But shh, you know what they say, if you're intelligent. You know what I think of the BBC in the modern day. They paid 22 million for the voice, it's true. They're not worth a million, they haven't a clue. They moved the BBC, literally, and paid all the staff to move, you see. They went to Manchester to save money, allegedly, but they paid all the staff to move, with see. They've hardly employed any, any Mancunians, it's true. The BBC are taking the piss and they haven't a clue. They charged me so much money to watch my TV, and now they're saying I can pay for foreign countries to get it for free. Listen to the BBC, literally, you're taking the piss out of the UK, you see. You live in a different world, it's true. You're blown away millions and you're having a clue. I'm so fed up with it, what can I say? I don't even want to pay for the UK, BBC, it's not okay. The days of them caring and being kind have gone, it's true. They're so full of shizer, what can you do? There's nothing I can say or get on TV. They're not interested in the UK ports or me. I've tried my best, literally. Well, this goes out to the BBC. As far as I can see, and I know it's true, they live on a different planet, they haven't a clue. 22 million for the voice I've got to say, I'm repeating myself, I'm not annoyed by the way. I can't get on TV to do instantaneous poetry, but they can shot away money for free. Do all these foreign countries, I don't care about Arab countries, that's me. I don't want them to get free TV, I want me in the UK to get it, so screw thee. Thank you.